inflation has hit so many of us, but for those on fixed incomes, it's been especially hard. Wisconsin State Representative David Steffen has recently proposed a potential tax break for the senior population. Our reporter Lindsay Stanger has that story. There is no question that Wisconsin residents are getting older and older. In fact, the Wisconsin Department of Health Services predict that by 2025, there will be over 6.2 million Wisconsin residents that are of retirement age. Whether you're Republican or Democrat, you understand that seniors were the most hit by the rising inflation rate that we've been experiencing. And Republican State Representative David Steffen and his team believe that they may have a solution. So for us to dedicate just over 6% of our structural budget surplus to seniors in this fashion, I think is incredibly reasonable and appropriate. The proposal will give a tax break to 98% of those over the age of 67. A lot of people aren't aware of how much of an impact senior citizens have on our communities and our economies. They are the largest contributor uh, to our charities and churches. They are the largest participants uh, in terms of uh, volunteering for our nonprofits. And they are light on, uh, light on the local government. The proposal will allow for up to $100,000 of tax-free income for single filers and up to $200,000 for married filers. And as Representative Stefan likes to say, Tax cuts are like burritos. They're all delicious. And so whether it's uh, my proposal or, an, or one that is similar, I think there's going to be a great opportunity to make sure that the people who actually paid that extra money in get it back. The proposal has been presented to the governor as of yesterday, and steps to move it forward or deny it will be determined next week. In Green Bay, Lindsey Stanger, NBC 26.